like a guy like Gil Brandt said, TCU should be embarrassed about how Gary Patterson's tenure ended. I'm sure you, this is not what you envisioned. No. No, this is not what we envisioned at all, and and it's certainly not what we wanted, and 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 um, and not what Gary wanted. So, you know, that's it's 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 probably easy to say that, um, but you know, ultimately, um, we had, uh, as I said, we had very we have very high expectations for this program, and that's because of Gary. You know, that's that's the irony of it is that he's built this program, and so we weren't meeting those expectations, and he would acknowledge that as well. So. Um, you know, I think Mac wrote a great piece about, you know, divorce never ends well. And, and I think any time a coach or, you know, a high-ranking um, professional leaves an organization, it's difficult to do that as well. So I think, you know, ultimately uh, we've, we've, we've done our best. Um, but in terms of uh, one of the common uh, criticisms is, well, it couldn't be handled better. And I'm sure you've seen it. It should be handled as differently. Uh, to, to people who say that, what do you say to, to that assertion? Um, gee, you know, I mean, it, it's, it's, if you weren't, uh, it's, it's probably a fair criticism just because I don't think anyone wanted it to end this way, but, um, I thought we handled this very fairly. Um, you know, we could have, um, gone through the season and hired a search firm, uh, behind coaches back. Would that have been fair? So, you know, what, what, what we've done here at TCU, which I'm very proud of, is that whenever we determine what's the right move or decision for the university, we then turn to what's the right and fair way to treat the employee when, it's, when, it's, uh, when it deals with an employee. And I, and I have 100% confidence we did that this time.